We're on the road heading back to one of our favourite places, the Fleury Peninsula. Once we arrived, I was so excited to check out the accommodation. We stayed at the Little Burrow, which is a brand new luxurious retreat at Aldinga. Isn't it gorgeous? The videos don't do justice on how magical this place is. We headed out for the day. First stop was the farmer's market. It's an eight minute drive away. There are so many stalls with fresh local produce. If you're staying at the Little Burrow, they give you a pass, which gives you 10% off all the vendors. Next, we stopped for lunch at Chalk Hill. The food and wine was a treat. We headed back to the Little Burrow to chill out before our dinner reservation at the Little Rickshaw. Usually it's hard to get a table here, but if you stay at the Little Burrow, they have a long-standing reservation, which means you don't have to worry about booking. The food did not disappoint and the cocktails were fab too. I was excited to get in my pajamas and binge watch Harry Potter. It was a late night, but so worth it. In your welcome letter, the Little Burrow shouts you two free coffees at Goodness Coffee Shop, which is next door. They also do a mean toasty. We took the cherry for a drive and ended up at Maxwell Wines. If you know Will and I, you know we're suckers for great food and wine. The tasting was paired with some savory snacks. They also have a giant maze, so we decided to go adventuring through it. Afterwards, I treated myself to a red wine and a hot bath. What a way to end the weekend.